What's up everyone, it's Ed from Bar Stars, and today I'll be reviewing the muscle up video. So last video I did was how to do the muscle up as far as the psychological point of view. And I asked you guys at the end of the video to send in some of your clips of you guys doing the muscle up. And I can tell you where you guys are doing wrong. Some guys, sent, a lot of people sent in videos, it was great to see all you guys muscle up. Uh, some people uh, wanted their feedback uh, privately, but some people volunteered to get their feedback publicly, which I think will be a great way for all of us to learn. Because then you get to see uh, someone else's example, and maybe you weren't able to record yourself, but now you could you might have a similar problem to what we're going to see today, and hopefully my advice could help you out. Um, I'm home right now, and I'll be watching the videos uh, live and giving my feedback as I see it, and uh, I'll try to replay it if there's a certain moment I feel like uh, we should all pay attention to. So the first video is Merber. I might have pronounced his name wrong. So here you see him; he does the muscle up. He actually does it uh, pretty good. There's some kip in there, but I think that's normal when you first learn to muscle up. Uh, a lot of people will criticize it, but most people learn to muscle up with kip involved. It's just the matter of the the truth. He's had two clips, so here's the second one. So again, he, he pretty much got the muscle up. There's things he could do to clean it up. Um, for example, if he worked through the progressions of uh, the negative muscle up, the straight bar dips, uh, jumping muscle ups, and uh, more pull ups, he could get it cleaner. Uh, I think really, really focusing on the negative muscle up is one of the number one things when it comes to cleaning up your muscle up. But overall, he has it, he could just make it better. Next up, we have is Anel. So uh, I've spoken to him a couple times via Instagram, and he is pretty advanced. He's not a beginner. And I'm sure this is not beginner muscle ups. And I was right. So uh, he has a pretty strict form. You see his legs don't move. He doesn't swing too much. He pretty much comes right in front of the bar and back up. It's really hard to even give this advice. I think it's, it's great muscle ups. Good job with now. Next up is Anthony. He wanted to know if he should work more on power or technique. So we'll see what Anthony... I have to watch this one a couple more times. But I feel like uh, it, that pull-up bar is a really hard pull-up bar to start at. It's uh, It doesn't allow you to swing or kick too much. You're stuck at this very... Uh, you know, there's like a door right in front of his legs, so he can't swing or kick. So I think uh, trying to do your first muscle-up on something that has a barrier is, is not a good idea. It's really hard. It is possible, but again, it's, it's not something I would advise for beginners because that kind of pull-up bar just makes it so much harder. Now, as far as the strength and technique, um, I would say both. I would say his strength, you see that he pulled really somewhat high, but uh, it, it looked like he was struggling to get at the very top of the bar. For someone who could muscle up, the pull up at the very top, or at least the top portion of the attempt of a muscle up should be have you somewhere here. If you're trying to do a muscle up and you're having trouble pulling to your chest, then you can't do a muscle up uh, strength wise. And even on the technique, uh, your, your technique is wrong, Anthony. So you're trying to come up as a curve. It looks here like you're trying to pull straight up. You can't do a muscle up pulling straight up. You have to come at a curve. It's like you're going around the bar. You're not going from under it. So you got to curve around the bar. So my advice to you, Anthony, is really work on your pull-ups. And um, really just focus on bringing the pull-up bar to your chest before you even try to learn the muscle up. Just really try to slam the pull-up bar to your chest and focus on that as well as the other progressions I've shown but mostly the, the pull-up power um, besides that I would suggest that you try again and not at this type of pull-up bar maybe a pull-up bar at a park or a gym where your legs or your upper body have more freedom to, to range to be able to go up next we have Daniel and he wanted to know uh, how could he get stronger or more clean when performing muscle-ups so Daniel starts his muscle up with a swing, which makes it easier because you're coming up at more of an angle and a slight kip. My biggest advice, uh, Daniel, to make it uh, your muscle up cleaner is limit the swing when you practice. So don't swing so aggressively. Uh, do it at a gradual pace. So swing a little less each time. But keep a note of how much you're swinging and try to trail it back and work on your negative muscle ups. So when you get to the very top, really control coming down. And now it's going to help you build the strength. And that's what personally helped me a lot to clean up my muscle up. 
you got the technique down, but it, if you, I do agree that you have a uh, space to clean it up. So focus on those negative muscle ups and try to gradually decrease your swing. Uh, unfortunately, I can't pronounce this last guy's name. So, um, yeah. Let's see the muscle up. That was actually pretty close. All right, I think he has the right technique. Um, I think the bar being so short is a dis disadvantage when you're that tall. You could do, once you learn the muscle up, you can kind of do it anywhere, but preferably when you first learn it, you want to have uh, your arms fully extended so that you're able to pick up the momentum. And uh, unfortunately, he doesn't have the space or room to do this on this bar. Also, it comes that uh, the bar's curved. Again, makes it more difficult. Once you can muscle up, of course, it's nothing. But if you're still learning to muscle up, learning it on a curved bar is... Uh, makes it much more difficult. So technique wise, he gets the curve of going around the bar. He gets the idea of he has to move his legs and he has to uh, move his wrists. He has that pretty good. So it looks like the only thing he could be missing is the strength. He needs to work more on those pull ups. I think he could actually really get it, you know, even his strength would make it clean, but I feel like he has the appropriate strength as of now to be able to do a muscle-up. Not a clean muscle-up, but he's able to do his first muscle-up. It's just the inconvenience of the bar, and again, he could be holding himself psychologically, which the, the last video covered. I feel like he he's really getting really high. I think you could work a little bit more on those explosive pull-ups just to be very confident, but I think if you tried it at a different bar and you let go of the mental barrier that you can and can't do it, and just know that you're going to do it, that you're at the end of a cliff and you have to do it to survive, I think you could get it. Um, the technique is, is on point. You got the idea of the swing, the movement of the legs, and switching the hands over. I would feel better if you got better at your explosive pull-ups. But even now, I feel like you may be able to have it. So uh, go to the park, hopefully somewhere, a different bar where you have more space because you look like a tall guy. Um, try three different attempts of trying to muscle up, but really trying it. You know, have your favorite song going, have your friends pump you up. And then after that, you keep working on your pull-ups. I repeat that, and I guarantee you in two weeks, you'll get the muscle up. Or, or less. I, I feel like you're ready. But at the most, two weeks. All right, guys. I hope you guys learned uh, from these uh, fine gentlemen's examples. I hope my feedback, you guys, was able to resonate with you, some of you guys. And, um... Keep sending in the videos, and maybe we'll do a, a series of, of me giving you guys uh, feedback. Uh, this was actually a lot of fun, and uh, I, again, thank you to the guys that were featured in the video. What's very important is that you guys click the bell down below. I plan on making more informative videos and more tutorials and more workout routines, and you don't want to miss it. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, check out the links in the description, and peace.